Investigators are back on the scene this morning uh, where construction workers found an infant's body yesterday. They found the remains in a pile of dirt in Weewahitchka where they're building a fast food restaurant. As News 13's Jake Holter tells us, Gulf County Sheriff's officials are doing everything they can to figure out more details. Workers found a child's remains around 2.30 Tuesday afternoon at the intersection of Highway 71 and Chipola Avenue. Gulf County Sheriff's investigators were able to confirm it was the mummified skeletal remains of an infant. They were back at the site Wednesday with a cadaver dog searching for more clues. And more help will arrive Thursday. Tomorrow we have the uh, Florida Department of Law Enforcement. Um, their crime scene lab will be coming in from Pensacola. Um, they have a ground penetrating radar system that will be able to examine down into the soil and the area, detect potential uh, anomalies there. We'll go in there and uh, explore those, excavate that area there and uh, sift through it. Harrison says he's unaware of any missing person reports that would be related to this discovery. He confirmed there used to be a funeral home on the site, but he says they have yet to determine the origin of the remains, saying they may have been in some of the dirt that's been dumped on the property. It's a difficult case. You've got an infant, um, you know, that uh, didn't have a proper burial. No matter what happened, where it happened, where it originated, they didn't have a proper burial. And uh, um, we've already been contacted by members of the community, um, the city of Weewahitchka that owns the, uh, um, the, the cemetery. And uh, uh, when all is said and done, you know, we'll have a proper burial for this. The medical examiner was scheduled to perform an autopsy Wednesday. Investigators hope it will provide more clues. In Weewahitchka, Jay Coulter, News 13, Panhandle Strong. Harrison says if necessary, the remains will be sent to experts at the Universities of Florida or Tennessee to gain a clearer picture of what happened.